I'm mean, Monday here on the Now Today, and today we're talking about a controversial topic involving kids and social media. The Now KC's Allison Bruner back with us now uh, with that story. Justin, it's a topic parents just can't avoid. How young is too young to be online? How much should a parent supervise online? Every parent has an opinion on it. Today I sat down with one local mom to see what she thinks. In Jill Hickey's household, there's one golden rule for social media. My family rule is if you um, unfollow me on Twitter or if you defriend me on Facebook or you don't follow me back on Instagram back and forth, then that shows me that you're up to something. Like you're posting something or saying something that otherwise you wouldn't say in front of an adult. Jill has four kids ages 6 to 17, and keeping an eye on their social accounts is now just business as usual for her as a parent. It's my, my reading in the morning. I check everybody's timelines. I check everybody what they posted. Luckily for Jill, she's a social media guru herself, and she uses her expertise to monitor her own kids. Like they unfollow me on Tattle to Daddy. I said, there must be something going on because I got an unfollow or a defriend or I got a block for a moment. Today, when it comes to knowing what the kids are up to, the Internet is where they're hanging out. According to a new study by the American Academy of Pediatrics, 22% of all teens are logging onto their favorite social media sites more than 10 times a day. And with that high level of online engagement, the impact of social media on a child's self-esteem can be massive. They will post a photo, and if they don't get a certain number of likes, they'll take it down. We don't want to overshare and create a generation of narcissists. But at the same time, Jill reminds her kids that their posts are a reflection of who they are. Again, I've tried to instill the honor system. If you post something or if you say something, it's reflection on you and this family and the way you were raised. Jill encourages parents to be on the same platforms as their kids and get involved. Jump in there and be on it yourself. Come to Twitter, people. Come play with us. It's very fun. And it's definitely a talker, but we want to get your opinion when it comes to your kids and social media. We post a question for you over on our Now KC Facebook page that we would love to get your feedback on when it comes to uh, that topic about kids and social media. Mm, hot topic. Go to the really Facebook is. page and uh, get involved. Thank you, Allison. So much.